What's up guys, this is Will Witt with PragerU. Today we're at UCSD talking to students about Che Guevara, the Che Cafe on campus based after him, and the new college on campus and what it should be named. Let's see what students think about him. So what is the Che Cafe all about? Uh, so the Che Cafe is kind of a lot of things. It's part DIY music venue, it's part like, student community center, it's part like vegan kitchen, and it's also a space for like radical ideologies, and it's also a safe space. So when you say like radical ideologies, do like Trump supporters come here? Oh no, we mean more like leftist political oh, okay. ideas. Yeah. No, we don't. No. If they start saying stuff that makes that violates our socialist policy, which includes like no racism, no transphobia, it's like then we'll like kick them out and stuff. Yeah. Does that include like no homophobia? Yeah, no homophobia, no transphobia, no racism. I was just wondering because you know it's named after Che Guevara, who you know put a lot of homosexuals in prison in Cuba. Do you know who Che Guevara is? No. No. Do you know about Che Cafe on your campus? I do. Yeah. You know who Che Guevara is? Uh, no, I don't. That guy? Oh my God! You I seen have that guy? seen him. Yeah. 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 Oh. So this is the, like you, I'm sure you've seen people on your campus have his shirt on yeah, or something. Yeah, I have. Yeah. A great man from what I know. I've listened to an interview by Che, it seemed passionate, it seemed like it was rooted in human rights. Everything that he did, did for the Cuban revolution, even outside of that, and even uh, with that, the way he died, like, if it was a badass, just like, to the very end, like. Che Guevara was a, a communist in the 1960s who helped um, overthrow the government in Cuba with Fidel Castro. And they, they herald someone like Che Guevara as a, a political hero, as a revolutionary, when really he killed thousands of people and imprisoned homosexuals and took away people's rights. A horrible person. So why is it um, named after him? Because there are students on your campus and people in America who are very dumb. So you said you're anti-capitalist? Yeah, I'd, I'd say so. Yeah. Um, why do you say that? I mean, I'm, I'm American and um, I've been in the neoliberal capital system that we live in for like 21 years now and um, I am very poor and a minority um, and yeah a lot of there's just a lot of different ways that uh, capitalism has genuinely ruined my life or my family's and those around us and I'm privileged enough to be at a university where I can speak about it and learn about it but I know the majority of people can't. Yeah. So like these clothes and stuff I mean that's a product of capitalism isn't it? Actually um, so I really don't want to contribute to fast fashion um, so I try not to buy any of my clothes new um, I try to buy my clothes from thrift stores, which still, it's weirdly, oddly enough, like, incentivizes Capitalism. People. I know this looks like it would catch the giraffes that escape from uh, the San Diego Zoo, but really, it is an art project. That's art, and it cost taxpayers a million dollars. This was a million dollar art project. Nice going, California. We're kind of asking people whether they would rather have the new college named after Che Guevara, as the Che Guevara College, or as the Ronald Reagan College. Which one would you rather have? Well, not Che Guevara College, definitely. Ronald Reagan is much more suitable because this is the U.S. Che. Che? Yeah. yeah. Well, obviously, I would, I would go with Ronald Reagan for I believe he's, especially for Americans, a way more important figure. Ronald Reagan was staunchly against uh, LGBT people and also minorities, especially black poor people. But on the same note, I don't know anything about Che Guevara and I don't know about any, you know, violence that he's enacted. Would you rather have it named the Ronald Reagan College or the Karl Marx College? Car Karl Marx does sound like it would be a good name for it just because of uh, how important he does sound and everything. I guess I'd prefer Marx over Reagan but that's just me. You know much about Ronald Reagan at all? Uh, yeah, I do know that. No, that was Nixon. Where are you from? I'm from Russia. Do you like communism? No. What, what do you think about communism? It's not good. It's like the, yeah, only opinion the, I have. There you go. Yeah. Well, that's a great opinion to have. Yeah. Keep that opinion forever, okay? <laughs> All right, guys, so we just finished up at UCSD, and we found that some students liked Che Guevara, some students didn't, but most students had no idea who he was. And so once I actually educated them and told them about it and gave them information, they were shocked to know that there was a cafe on campus called the Che Cafe. So we appreciate you guys watching. This has been Will Whiff for PragerU. Like, comment, everything else. Share this video with your friends. See you in the next one. Peace. I know you. You, you know me? You are a conservative tank, right? Uh huh. Nice. Yeah, Prager, you know Prager? Yeah, I think I saw a couple of videos on YouTube. You know who I am? No. Oh. Well, sorry. <laughs> Heartbreaker.